All right, we're back. Look what we have here. A worn box with actual staples from the factory. Well, that's amazing. Needs to say, kids, the last box ain't going so well with the old uh, trying to sort out. Oh, we're going to solve that riddle. All right, what do we got here? Whoops. It's the 920s double O tube kit front plow mount. A blah 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 ATV whatever that's what this is date 6 25 21 so it's pretty fresh let's uh let's pop her open see what she got let's see what we got well it was raining the box a little soggy <laughs> all right where's the where's the seam and maybe we'll just slide this one out Goodness, I'm a beast. I'm a whatever. So, uh, let's get this thing up here. You can stare at me being a bit of a fool here. Hopefully, this isn't going back because I'm about to. What am I going to do here? I'm just going to lay this flat. I'm not going to lie, I've been, not been having the greatest luck lately with the uh, some of my purchases. We're just gonna go ahead and have a dinger in the back end. There we go. We're just gonna do that. Well, let's let's be proud of her. Let's put our brag badge up, right? Oh, okay. Woo! All right, what do we got here? This is the push tube assembly. And that, my friend. Nice. First, first off, nice paint job, Warren. Jeepers creepers just or that's powder coat. How are you kidding me? Is everything I'm gonna buy just a piece of junk? This came from Amazon. I mean I guess whatever. I just gotta lower my expectations. Whatever. <laughs> I just so yeah. What a what an underwhelming item. It's thick. Let's see what we got here. I mean, this is just the unboxing for my benefit because I've been getting some treasures lately. Like, what are you talking about? We don't sell open box. I'm like, uh, yeah, bud. Uh, I videotaped it. Oh, that's what I got. We're, we're, I'm still dealing with that. So we get a, a box, we get a whole pile of junk there. So, I mean, if you've got a worn plow, I mean, I don't know, maybe I'm out of my mind here. Let's take a look here. That's the push tube assembly. Still waiting on the uh, the actual mount for my machine. It's It came from Canada, apparently. It's going to be here tomorrow. So... If you didn't see my other video, this was uh, this was purchased new, brand new. It's a, it's a Warren Pro Vantage. It's got a little, I, I noticed later, it's got a little missing scuff there. That's okay, I can live with that. It's got a little scuff there. I can live with that. But what I'm having a problem with is I don't think that's the correct cutting edge. The correct cutting edge should have the, the holes should be up here and this whole thing should be cut. This is the reversible. Now, I don't know if this is their aftermarket or their... How do I describe it? I mean, this is the other thing. This, this was my first clue. Wear bar inside. That's packaging for a wear bar. And then it came with wear bar inside packaging. It came with both packaging. So I know something's up. Like, I know something's up. Here's the box it came in. I don't want to film too much. I think I took my, my tags off. But it was all taped together. They had, they had re-strapped it, but like all the staples had been. Open. So it was an open box. So I'm going back and forth with the guy I bought it from. It's like, but what's bothering me is if you look right here, it's hard to see. But because this is a, a reversible, a flippable, I got an extra little gap right there. There's like a little gap. I mean, whatever. I mean, that may be a worn edge. I don't know. I mean, I don't know. It's not the one that's supposed to come on because I called worn direct. Talk to technical support. Describe the blade that I got. The guy's like, no, that doesn't come with that blade. It comes with the blade with the holes up here to push all that steel down. It's not. So, and then I got this. The worn 
18 630 pulley and I'll show you what that's going to replace because I mean I, I thought about just using this until it breaks but then I realized man everything I've been reading so this ends up going like right there but what what it comes with is this thing you see that it's like a plastic half pulley and I don't know maybe the internet's just lead me astray tell me it's going to be bad news bears but I don't know, I picked it up for like 15 bucks. It's that a three-way, I can, I, I can mount it three different directions. I watched uh, a guy's video, uh, Montana Jacks, I think it is. So this can go, let's see here, get this pin off. Ooh, those are strong retentions. Big beef. So like, you can either go through like, he said like that one, I guess, or you can go through like that one or something, or it goes this way, or I don't even know, or you gotta come with a black, I don't even know. I'm loving that. Can you see that garbage? Just garbage. And this is from Amazon. This isn't some shady, I saved a buck thing. This is the full jammy jam, and it just comes garbage. Look at the backside. Let's get the full disaster. What's the bottom side of this thing look like? Ah! Well, the powder coating on the bottom side is nice, so. I mean, it's stout. That is a stout piece of something. And I'm not going to bore you with an assembly video, because, like, uh, who wants to watch me put shit together? <sighs> I mean, right, whatever. That's it. That's my jam. I don't know how long I've gone, but... I just, I just kind of wish that sometimes things which just kind of go the way they're supposed to, man. I mean, like from what I could tell, there was no real way to do this kit by buying all at once, so. Let's, I'll, I'll, I'll show you a couple things in here that I, am I, am I getting this? I'll back it up a little. A couple things about this kit that I thought were kind of cool and really made me think, okay, this is the way to go. The first one was actually this, this pulley system. I mean, not this pulley, I mean, I'm replacing it, but the fact that they're doing a, it's like a string comes down to there and then your hook goes in there. So you got like this, it helps with your angles. I mean, whatever. But this is, look at them bushings, a little big old fat bushing on there. That's for the plow pivot. And the other thing is, like, I thought this plow handle uh, deal was kind of nice. It was a big, it's a big one up top where you just ch -ch pull it. So, yeah, I mean, that's where I'm at. I just got to wait for my my uh, package tomorrow, and that's everything. Well, I'm actually, one thing's still, one thing's still on back order. I decided I'm this deep into it. I'm just going to do it right. So I've got a. I've got a single two inch uh, radius roller to replace this. I'm doing a separate rope so I don't smoke my 50 footer. I'm getting a 12 foot rope. And then uh, it comes with another, like, uh, another set of pulleys. I don't know if I can get a pulley up into there, like come across the front of the hood down, but I'll have a spare uh, hook. I won't have to use this hook. I'll, I, I've got a hook coming, the 12 foot rope, the roller uh, fair lead, Designed for synthetic, and then I got a, a, an extra pulley block, I guess. That's more for an ATV style, but it's on back order, so. Uh, I think it gets in, let's see, what's today? Probably two weeks from now I should get that. I don't know the color, too. That's like, co colors vary on the rope, so I'm like, ew, I hope I get like a black or a red or a green and not like an orange, but I may call them and see if I can get... I'm getting that through Moto Alliance. That's who my winch is coming through. That's my winch is a Moto Alliance winch, Moto Alliance mount. So I figure I just go with Moto Alliance on that flare lead pulley because I got kind of a. I'm back in a little bit. I don't know. I could. I don't know how it's going to work. I just figured there's a little extra money, but I mean, once you're this deep in, what's another whatever? You know, you just go for it. Get it done. Get it done. So. Yep, that's where we're at. So I'm fighting, not fighting. I sent photos today. I don't know what they're gonna do. I really don't want to ship that blade back. I just it just bothers me to 
If it's an open box, used, whatever, just tell me that and then give me a price appropriate and I could probably live my life, but don't tell me it's brand new and charge you brand new prices. Like this is bumming me out, I'm not gonna lie. That garbage, that is trash. That is absolute trash. Am I gonna send it back? Probably not, but like, should I? Probably, but I'm not going to, because it's like, Jesus. Send everything back that I buy, I won't ever have anything, so whatever. So that's where we're at. I'm not, like I said, I'm not gonna do the assembly video because that shit's boring. And if you can't figure out how to put one of these together, you shouldn't be putting it together yourself. Pay a professional, stay safe.